Hey guys, Rob Money here. Uh, today I wanted to talk about how to find new fishing spots. So best way I do it is I use Fishbrain. It's an app on your phone. Uh, if you subscribe to the pro version, I think it's like 60 or 70 a year. You can actually see exact spots people catch at. Everyone's posting on Fishbrain, so there's always lots of new uh, places to look. So mix Fishbrain with Google Maps. Look for some water, see if anyone's fishing there. Uh, if you click on the catch, you can even see people's comments on it. Usually people ask, how did you get there? Where did you park? That kind of stuff. So that's the best way I've found so far, um, especially if I'm looking for something kind of off the beaten path. Stay tuned. Let's see what I find. I don't know. The new Bassmobile 1999 Volkswagen Jetta. Catching bass with class. Okay, that was not the way, so I just walked a mile uh, the opposite way of the water. So that's fun. That's real nice. Because I'll just go back. Alright, got a little one. Nice. I didn't want to miss it again, so I set that hook. All right, not big at all, but you know, it's nice to get one on the line. Come on, buddy. All right, as you can see, we get him back in the water. Definitely catch and release, even if he was big. Want them to keep growing and keep spawning. Thanks for playing. Put them down to where I can not splash them from too high above. There we go. Boy swam right off. Yeah, there's like, oh, hold on. Ugh. Got one, gotta get over the, yep, there it is. All right, another small one. Oh well. Just shot the worm across the across the galaxy. I don't even know where the worm went. All right, it's all right, buddy. It's all right. It's okay. Another small one, but it's nice. I mean, we were getting bite after bite. This little secluded water by a neighborhood. All right, man. Time to go back in the water so you can grow up and get big. There's a good spot for you. See you later. <laughs> All right. Got one? Oh, set the hook. There you go, get it in. Get it in over the, over the grass. Pull it in, pull it in more. Put in more. Take a step back. There you go. There you go. Nice. Great job. That makes what three today? Yeah, I guess. I caught one and I didn't really bring them up. There you go. You can put your finger in its lip to get the hook out, or you can grab the whole fish. Turn towards me. Did the camera see? Yeah. It's 
so you don't have to use live worms to catch fish. It's awesome. Great job. There you go, grab it. And then get the hook out. It's gotta go out the way it came in, so just push it. Need some help? Yeah. Oh, there you go. No, you got it. Now, there you go, and everyone let everyone see it. Now you can go ahead and throw it in the water. Not too from too high, but there you go. Great job. Thank you. That feel good? Yeah, actually. I haven't caught one in a long time. Long hair, you don't care. Catching bass. All right, another one. Well, I keep getting it smaller and smaller, but at least I set the hook this time. I know, brother, I know. So you can tell this, this spot is not very pressured. Lots of bites, lots of small bass. Let's see if there's anything bigger in here. All right, later, player. Now the point of this really is using fish brain to find places that are just not so pressured, especially if you live in a big city. It seems like most of the easy to get to and easily known fishing spots are just pressured all day long. Then you find these spots that are kind of not pressured at all and everything just seems to be biting. Now we're gonna see if there's any big fish in here though. That's gonna be the kicker. It's always nice when you look down and your leg's just an ant pile. That's nice. Got one first uh, first cast. Small. I was like, oh, I'm gonna go after bigger fish now. Still got a small one. All right, it's okay. I got you, buddy. Hmm. To the unicorn. Let me get this out of you. So terrible. Okay, buddy. All right. Got another one. I don't know, this is like six or seven today. Nothing big, but it's fun when you, to me it might be even more fun catching a lot of small fish versus one medium sized fish, but there's nothing more fun than catching one big chunky boy. Yeah, cool man, go back in, see you later. If you enjoyed the video, please subscribe to the channel. Uh, again, we are going to be doing one or two videos a week. Uh, so subscribe. That way you don't miss any new content. Uh, lots of fishing. Really, it's about it. But if you like it, subscribe. See you next time.